Welcome back, everybody. Welcome back. <laughs> this little guy still hasn't hatched. Not that we've been logged in or anything, but I mean, it is night. Where's the Where's the baby? We should have a baby and a big guy in here. Yeah, there's a big guy. I see. We'll see the baby currently there. Let's see. So I know that you don't keep up with the news too much. You say. It's off and on. Sometimes it's it's. I, I think I said that there was definitely a period where I'd stop reading everything, but then sometimes I do. So bring it at me. <laughs> have, have you kept up with the story about the uh, Florida state house candidate? Huh. I don't know anything about this. This this woman. Was I don't running... see this turtle, by the way. Uh, I don't see him either. Did he go back down? Um... Oh no, he's right. He's right here. I got him. Oh, I see him now. Okay. Um, so th this woman, she was running for a Florida State House seat, and I guess the college that she went to, um, oh, it was University of Miami, I can't remember what it was, uh, I guess they came out on Twitter and said something like, you know, you, you, she talks about graduating from our university, but, you know, we actually don't have record of her graduating. No oh, shit. And... So I, I don't know all the details because I wasn't following it that terribly closely until it all like really hit the fan. So she apparently tweeted out a picture of her sitting with her diploma and the college actually came out and said, you know, they, like they came out and apologized, like and said something, you know, sorry for, you know, not the misunderstanding, you know, I don't know exactly what they said, but they basically said sorry. And then I guess the next day they came back out and said, and factually, upon further investigation, you know, we really don't have a record of this graduation. And in looking at your picture with your diploma, a degree that we have never offered is what is written on there as being conferred from our university. What the fuck? So she, uh, apparently she came real close to graduating, but never graduated and has been going, I don't know for how long, on saying that she graduated and went as far as to refute the claims by creating a fake diploma and posting How she it. had to know that this was going to end poorly well and then the the craziest part is she was refusing to drop out of the race at first uh after being called to drop out of the race for how like ridiculous it was that she would do something like that she finally has dropped out of the race but she stated in her statement how her actions were in no way meant to deceive or uh, portray something other than reality or something along those lines. And, so, and I what? personally can't understand, like, if you're going to be as crazy of a person as to completely lie about having a degree and then going and trying to like cover it up with obvious lies and deception. Like you're, you're photoshopping something to give the illusion that you're sitting next to your, you know, the, your fake degree that you made. And then to come out and talk about how your actions were not meant to be dis deceitful. That's insane. Or deceiving. Sounds like she's a crazy person. I mean, really? Like, I mean, this is like the definition of of being this de of deceiving, I, I, right? And that's where, like, I, I mean, I I get it's a political world. People lie all the time. I think it's terrible, but it's you know something that you know, we all basically have accepted at this point in our lives that that's how it works, and it's shitty that it works that way, but it does. It's, I mean, in my opinion. You know, Trump does this kind of crap all the time, but at least he tr tries to do it in a way where he makes it sound as if he was like what the whole thing with uh, when he was with Russia. And he says, you know, what I actually said was I, w I, I, God, what do you say? The word wouldn't, wouldn't, I can't remember which context they were used in, um, which completely changed the context of everything he said. Like, um, I would, I, I. I wouldn't see why not or whatever it was. You know what I'm talking about? I do. Um, so Maybe he was that, in Russia. At least or he, not in Russia, but yeah. At least he tried to be deceitful and come back with a reason why it was basically a misunderstanding. I don't even know how you come back from something like 
It's like it's like if I turned in a fake resume to a company and then they fired me after hiring me because they realized that it was a fake resume and I was like, I didn't mean to deceive you with that resume, <laughs> right? It's like, like, come on, I was just guys. A good, good time. <laughs> it's it's only it game. It wasn't meant to be deceitful at all. That's just like the the resume I give out. <laughs> That's it, just resume. Yeah, I got some mistakes on there. I need to go clean it up or something. It's uh, it's not entirely accurate. God, it's like uh, Jared. Kushner's um, uh, de declarations of <laughs> money. Just, just got to revise it 12 times. <laughs> I, I couldn't remember about all that money I lied about. I mean... Uh... <laughs> okay, they're both adults now. Oh, they're both adults? Are you going to... Are you gonna make them? Make them yeah, I've took out the fences game? for now, and we'll see just to kind of see what they do. Um, what I did is I forced that one to grow up by force feeding him. <laughs> <laughs> so he's no longer an organic turtle. Well, these are all organic seaweed. I mean, is that seagrass? If you, if you or... force feed a chicken in a, a breeding pen, does that? Uh... It doesn't make him less organic. Okay, so I guess what is the definition of organic then? Organic is just no, I mean, I don't know the exact definitions, but there can be no um, chemical pesticides, that sort of stuff. Uh, a lot of times, no antibiotics. I don't know. I don't, oh, I don't I was know. Thinking, I'm sorry. I was thinking free range. Oh, uh, okay. All right. They've they they've done the dirty. Now this one's going one way and the other one is, one of them just doesn't, oh, one of them just kind of like fucks off after well, well only one of them is going to like lay the eggs right they don't both right i think i think this one is trying to get to where yeah you it started to, but it doesn't have a path you have to break the fence i'm gonna come back over there i went over to the well no it doesn't even it's not even trying to get i think it's trying to get there on land yeah it is it's trying to get there on land oh so it's not trying to go through the water up to the beach and will they go to the exact same spot or just somewhere by a sand block in that area. I think it's the exact same spot, but this boy's gonna have a hard time getting there. Back. He may never get there. I mean, I wouldn't say never. I'll push him back in the water and see if he can figure it out or she. I guess it's she's the she. You need to. You gotta go a different way, buddy. Okay, I pushed you back in the water. See if it works out the math here you know what i think it i think it failed in the egg laying uh so it was trying to go it was this one right here and it was trying to go to where this other egg still is but it was trying to make take the the straightest path there and it couldn't well maybe it's still trying i'm not sure so we just push it down this uh yeah get down here go this way <laughs> Come on, quit, quit forcing against me. This clearly isn't the. Oh, are you just gonna lay right here? No, it got up on. It's gonna. It's trying to get there. I mean, we would have helped you, buddy. I think maybe it's gonna get in the water now. Come on, bud. Go, go, go. Okay. Go, go, go. Okay. Now, now what is it go. doing? That's not where you're not where you came from. Well, we actually don't even know if this is where you came from. Yeah, I wish you could tag the turtles. Well, we could Turtle with a name tag. Why are you trying to get up yeah. there, bud? I feel like I'm talking to my son. Well, what are you doing? <laughs> no, you're going the wrong way. <laughs> okay, okay. Now I think he's got it worked out. He's got it worked out. I think he's about to lay some eggs. Well, Hopefully he doesn't break these other, other eggs. One. I'm worried it might. Okay, this is a spot. Do the dirty. Do the dirty. Well, you did the dirty. Do the <laughs> other part of the dirty. The nine months <laughs> later for humans dirty. <laughs> Shit the bed. It's okay. Everybody does. Um, so I have two scoots now. What do, do we find out what to do with those? I forgot. I think you could make turtle shell helmets out of them. 
Did anyone comment? So I lost those two episodes, and then one of those episodes is one the one where I cheated and gave us all the recipes. Did anyone comment about that? I haven't put it up yet. Oh no, no, no you, did. I did. No, you did. You uh, did. Somebody did comment about the recipes. Uh, saying something like, God, what they say exactly? Like, oh, it was so sad to watch all the work of those recipes just go away. And then there was a lot of people trying to just tell me how the recipe lookup works. I don't think anybody really cared. <laughs> I could be wrong. Maybe they just stopped watching the channel because... <laughs> they completely they left. left. They were like, ah, oh, mm -hmm. done. It's over. Okay, I think this curve is over. I remember it took one of them a while to actually do anything. I'm going to go get some more of this sea kelp. Yeah, there's a turtle shell helmet. How'd you know that? I don't. <laughs> I mean, I guess we would have got that recipe when we got the first scoot. Technically. But it doesn't look like... It says it's like two armor. So it's not that good. It just looks cool, maybe? Maybe. Okay, where are you? See how much armor the other helmets are. I got you in love again. Huh. Diamond helmet has something called armor toughness as well as armor. Oh. How I guess maybe it's more dur durable? It's more tough. That's weird. Because, like, so I'm looking at helmets here, and the iron helmet is two armor. The golden helmet is two armor. And the diamond helmet is three armor, so is gold and iron helmet's the same? Oh, it laid! It laid! Nice! I tried to it laid make two, them, didn't it? I tried to make them do it again. And that one wasn't ready, because it was in the middle of laying eggs. I'm worried because it's on top of them. It's going to crack them, isn't it? Uh, the turtle itself shouldn't crack them, right? I, mean, I think it can. Really? I think it did before, it whenever we were watching. I heard a crack one time. I mean, I stomped on him and cracked him, that's for sure. Yeah. You rubbing your junk all over that? There you go. <laughs> Scenting it real good. We should probably fence this back. Oh, you yeah. probably should get that out of your hand. That's what's freaking it out. Uh oh. Sorry, bud. Nah, oh, yeah. It was done. Maybe. Uh, I don't know. Maybe not. If you crush those eggs, you might. I can't believe this one still hasn't. Yeah, that's thrown. that's a rotten egg. You are the one we have the most hopes for. Squid, yeah. I'm afraid you're gonna come on land and like crush this turtle. It's turtle. Oh yeah, you inked me. Wow, <sighs> and you took off. Oh yeah, we can get buckets of fish now, right? Can you? What's that do? I don't know, but I think it was one of the new things in here. Let's find a fish. I'm gonna go over to the ocean and get a bucket of fish. It's like uh, Long John Silver's. You get a bucket of fish. The eggs still haven't cracked under the weight of that turtle, so I think it's good. Could be right. When I look for a bucket of fish, I don't see no nothing in the recipes. Really? I could have sworn I saw it was... Because didn't you say there's a bucket of fish that you can get in a... Like... That's on the iPad. Right. I and think. I thought they added it in this update, I was told. Oh, I don't know. They're still here. Let me see. Oh. oh, we could bring some turtle eggs over there, actually. Yeah, we could. That's, That's a nice place for them. Got me. I should have. Should have grabbed those ones. Um, I don't know if he's staying to protect these eggs or what he's doing. How is it? I don't know if it, is it bucket. Oh, of fish it's done. Actually, catching fish or is it putting fish in the bucket like in your inventory? I don't know. I don't see a craft recipe for it, so I don't know. Because these are we don't have fish in these biomes over here. Maybe if you, I think it's not deep enough. Or use something. a bucket on some fish. Well, it's, I need to find fish though. Right. And All right. I'm gonna leave him to his to his doings. Did you close it off at least? No. I don't want to close it off with him in there. Well, I guess I'll wait. The zombies might get to it. Yeah. Let's 
Good point. I don't know what he's doing. <laughs> I never know what he's doing in there. Meatloaf? <laughs> What the hell? I think there's lag in the fact that I can't get my elytra to like open up very easily anymore. And now he's throwing sand. Was he burying more? I don't know what he's doing. Oh, he laid another egg. That's weird. Found fish. JSANO19 has made the advancement tactical fishing. So did you grab him in a bucket? I did. That's cool. Well, now what? I don't know. I'm trying to get out, but my elytra is staying like out. Uh, it's a bucket of salmon. Um, I don't know if I just now let it go. And, and I think just... you can push. I think you can pour them to other place. I think they did that so that you can put you can move fish around. I mean, like you can make to make an aquarium. Shouldn't they theoretically like create it something? Yeah, he's he's done his laying now. He's he's on his way. Let me go see if I can make a little one one spot for, for some fish. There's a new sound associated with flying. Apparently, I didn't hear before. Is that my volume too low? But it's like wrong. <laughs> okay, I'm close to the fence back in. Dive bomb. We'll probably have uh, these three new eggs hatch before this other one hatches. Okay, do you have a bucket of water on you? I do. Can you put like a one spot of water somewhere around here? And I'm just going to see if I throw the salmon in there, what happens? Okay. That's a lot of... Look, <laughs> salmon. So can I just grab him? Oh Ellie God! Has made the advancement oh. tactical okay, fishing. So it has to be a bucket full of water that you grab a fish, apparently, because you took the water yeah. first. <laughs> oh, that's cool. I didn't realize that they would do that. I guess I could add. That's him pretty to neat. To this. But will he despawn? Can you put name tags on fish? Oh, he won't release here. There it goes. Yeah, yeah. I do if... these type of. I guess they might despawn. I have no idea how this works. I mean, it's interesting that it can be done. Fishy. It's just kind of weird. Okay, this got to be the night that the other one catches, right? I would think. I mean. Really to break it. Maybe it's, it's an illusion. It doesn't actually exist. It's just no real egg. Oh, should I grab some of these and transplant them to the other beach? Uh, yeah. Yes, so touch. Yeah. Are you sure? Yes. <laughs> this one. Yes, so Dutch. One or two? Well, definitely two so we can breed them. Okay. That one good green spark was right before you broke it. Did you see that? I did not. The first one did. It's like right before you broke oh it. Oh my god, I just... <laughs> there was no way for me to get out of that fenced-in area, so I had the brilliant idea of using my elytra and uh, a firework, and I crashed into three trees on the way and <laughs> down to, like, two hearts by the time I stopped. Uh -huh. <laughs> I only stopped, like, ten blocks away from the fenced area. It's not like that went very well. Okay, so... 
And in theory, we should be able to put these. I'm hoping that. What if you put them on this little island in the middle? And there shouldn't be zombies. Right. What if you stick them right here, where I'm at? Iron Golem's taking a dip. <laughs> Maybe he's peeing. Could be. So do you pee in pools? Uh, I have. So let's go. Like that. Now that's your beach. I mean, how about you? Yeah, yeah I'm guilty. I think most people are, despite whether they yeah. admit it or not. That's the thing. I think most people won't, would not admit to it. Just like Peter, I try not to. People don't admit that. I think that's weird. I don't understand why people have an aversion to peeing in the shower. Like Chad freaked out on me when he found out I peed in the shower. I mean, if I have to, like, I think it's funny because, like, warm water and stuff touching your body makes you have to pee more. So do you like, right. get out of the shower to pee and then jump? That's back what in? he says he does. And he was like, "Please, whatever you stay at my house, don't pee in the shower." I was like, "Oh my god, really?" Say, ask him how close the toilet is to the shower. Like, could you arc it? From Can I the reach? Shower? <laughs> <laughs> Would it um, reach? Because that's the only way it's at, that's happening. <sighs> I mean, I guess yeah. some people, I don't know. It's, so, I guess I don't think that's some, something I was ever talked to about when I grew up, that you should or should yeah. do it. Yeah, I'm saying. I mean, I definitely remember being on boats and stuff in the lakes saying I had to pee. And my dad was like, just jump in the water. Like, so that right. was considered completely acceptable. Like, the ocean, it's no big deal. Everyone pees in the ocean, right? I mean, that's that's not, like, you know, ponds and all those things. I can understand the pool just because, I mean, you know. Actually, but the pool should be more able to be peed in because it gets treated with chemicals. I guess. Yeah. I guess. I don't know. I guess I think that the like the ocean or the pond stuff is so much bigger is the thought process. I mean, sure. Parts per is. million. So I mean, I somewhat get it from that perspective, but at the same time, I'm still like, you know, you, you treat you treat the pool, you treat the pool. Yeah. 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 Hmm. When you I'm ever, angry, uh, I drain you the ever been in the shower and like yes, had to fart? Yes, a few times. <laughs> and had to fart and did not be a fart? No. I've had that happen That before. has never accidentally happened to me. Yeah. <laughs> now I'm making you feel very embarrassed, but... No, 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 no. no. I, it's Shit happens. Like, literally. <laughs> yeah. I've definitely been at the urinal. I think we talked about this before. I've been at the urinal once when I was really drunk and tried to let it oh, out. Yeah. And it was, uh, mm -hmm. it was not <laughs> completely just a fart. Luckily, it was at my fraternity house and my room was like a door down. So I went and changed it. <laughs> it was not out <laughs> in the public, thank God. <laughs> that would be the worst. Oh, man. I hate the times like when you're in the middle of like a meeting or especially if you're driving is the worst and you just have that really upset stomach and you are about to explode out of nowhere and you know it and you have no way to do like you're at the mercy of how fast you can get to the next place yeah that is yeah, I hate the that. absolute worst my daughter does this thing where I'll say, hey, you need to use the bathroom? And she'll say no. And then we'll pass the gas station that she could have used the bathroom at. And then we're like two minutes down the road after that where there's not going to be another gas station for who knows how long. And she's like, I got to pee really bad. Well, you put it in her head. <laughs> I guess. I guess. But I asked at the gas station because I knew... I don't know. It seems to always happen on the way to the beach, like, because I know when how like how far apart the gas stations are at, and so I'll ask her like, "You need to go because this is gonna be the last one for a little while." She'll say no, and then it's like we get just far enough away that it's gonna be the same distance no matter what if I go back or forward. And then she's like, "I had to go so bad." Yeah, I think I think kids are <laughs> relatively notorious for that in general. <laughs> Luckily, my son is still in diapers. Yeah, he he's just being where he wants. Though, he's got this big thing now where he loves to play with his penis. I have the funniest <laughs> picture from him. I wish uh, I wish I could 
post. I probably could because it's like covered up, but I'm so concerned that it would be yeah. that people would construe it as like child pornography or something stupid right. like that. But it's he found a tape measure that was sitting downstairs and he literally <laughs> grabbed it and he, he put it. And I wasn't home. My wife sent me the picture. And he apparently took it and just immediately put it right to his penis and measured his penis. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a perfect picture to save. Oh, it is, oh it's life. a great picture. And I guarantee if I put it up on like you know, Twitter or something, it would probably be one of those ones that was just done so perfectly that would be instantly, like, viral because it's right. so cute and so funny, but I have this weird feeling that somehow it would come against me as being, like, a pedophile with, you know. Yeah, 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 yeah. You definitely shouldn't. Uh, but he is obsessed with his penis, and <laughs> I think that's relatively normal, but he's also obsessed with it to the point where if you'll take the diaper off of him, he runs to like a corner and just starts peeing because he finds it to be the funniest thing to oh, watch. Oh God, that's pee. awful. Um, he doesn't pee much. I mean, it's kind of good in some respects because it almost seems like he doesn't. He doesn't just pee. He's like actually controlling some, you know, some bladder control. Yeah, and that's true. So it might make potty training easier as we start to get to that route. Because he's not just because I always wonder like as a as a child are and I probably should know this from like nursing school but I really don't feel really like kids that much there. Do kids just is it a constant stream as the bladder makes stuff? Does it just come right on out? Is there zero like control or does it do they control it to a point and then it all comes out at once as if they were peeing? They just don't know how to judge the urge and when they need to release. It. Or not. I think it's I think it's the the latter because like otherwise like you know just from experience changing diapers like it wasn't like the diaper got a little bit wet over time it uh, it got it suddenly it got very to, wet yeah I guess I guess that does make sense it does go from nothing to full well that day is over the the thing did not hatch God damn it. That day is not over. The night is over. Which is, well, yeah, yeah. I'm tempted to right. go like destroy that. <laughs> no, it's gonna hatch eventually. What I wonder is if you break it in with so touch now, does it keep its state? Like when you place it back down, oh, we question. should test that with one of them. Like when one, one cracks a little bit, try breaking it and see, see if these it... have gotten to the next stage yet at all. Such as these Tough. ones are both in the same block, and I don't know what. Does that yeah, mean they're gonna they... hatch at the exact same time? Right, I wondered that too. Because there are eggs to hatch zero is what it says. Do they go to hatch one and hatch two together? Does it show multiple? Op like, does no, it? Does, does the hatch zero two just hatch zero? That's all it huh. says. Where'd you? How far did you go to find those fish? Uh, uh just over past the uh, the your apartment building, and I just flew on one like rocket and got to the ocean over there too. Huh. So Unless I right went the wrong there. way. Uh, okay, yeah, because I was going straight back and I couldn't find any ocean. Uh, slightly to the okay. right, but it gotcha. took me a, one rocket to get there, so. Okay, yeah, I just wasted like five rockets and didn't find the ocean. All right, well, we're out of time. I guess we'll, we'll do more turtle things next time. <laughs> <laughs> Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. All right, see ya.